I'm counting down each of Ash's Pokemon's best feet in the anime, and today we're traveling to Alola, starting off with God. God Rowlet's best feat is just existing, but beyond that, he did work in the Alola League, defeating Kakui's Braviary and showing House Decidueye who's daddy. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube for much more content. I'm counting down each of Ash's Pokemon's best feet in the anime, and today we have one of Ash's strongest Pokemon, Lycanroc. You guys already know Lycanroc's best feat. It's what had helped Ash win the Alola League, duh. But an honorable mention is definitely when Lycanroc defeated three of Nanu's Pokemon in one battle. I'm counting down each of Ash's Pokemon's best feet in the anime. And today we have Ash's Incineroar. Incineroar's best feat occurred when it was still a Tauracat and was able to defeat Professor Kakui or the Mask Royal's strongest Pokemon, Incineroar. I'm counting down each of Ash's Pokemon's best feet in the anime, and today we have Ash's Ultra Beast, Naganoddle. Naganoddle's best feat is definitely when it beat Professor Kakui's Lucario. I'm counting down each of Ash's Pokemon's best feet in the anime, and today we have Ash's first and only mythical Pokemon, Melmetal. Melmetal's best feat, of course, is when it took down Professor Kakui's Empoleon.